Welcome to this uh, lesson, uh, MM Publication, Module 1B, Full Blast, Vocabulary and Grammar uh, for the third intermediate grade. Uh, this is uh, going to be like the second lesson in our series. This lesson was uh, prepared by Mr. Abdullah Balbaid and will be presented by me, Hattan Sadiq. So let's move on. Okay, to warm up. Do you work out? How and where? Okay. Now, guys, I need uh, two confirmation. Uh, Sarah, you said that you can hear me. Hattan, can you hear me? Okay, good job. So, guys, do you work out? You know, working out. Working out is not like teaching or is not like being an engineer. Working out, it, it uh, means like, uh, uh, do you exercise? Yes or no? Hattan, do you exercise? Do you work out? Yes. Okay. Sir, sometimes? Okay. Uh, 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 where do you uh, uh, work out, Hattan? Like playing football. Okay, playing football is not working out. Working out means like exercising. Sarah, where do you work out? No problem. It's okay. Maybe at home, right? Okay, good job. All right. Working at home is fun. No one is going to bother you. You are not going to wait in line for uh, using a machine, which is good. No, it's, somehow it's boring unless you are, uh, for example, watching TV while working out or listening to something uh, interesting. Okay, do you know any computer games that help people keep fit? Do you know any computer games? No? Why? Come on. Do you know any computer games? Computer games that help people keep fit. For example, uh, that games, uh, for example, require the Wii. You, you mean the Nintendo Wii? It's not a computer game. This is uh, a computer game machine. So do you know an exact game? So, for example, like for running, playing uh, golf, or maybe tennis. Okay. Good job. So, let's move on. <clears throat> Here are the objectives for this lesson. To ask for, give, and refuse permission. Do you know the meaning of the word permission, guys? When you ask your father, for example, can I go uh, to the party? Here you are asking for permission. Okay. To express possibility and ability. <clears throat> to, to express obligation, lack of obligation, and prohibition. Okay. Scan the website quickly and answer the questions. Okay, here is the website. So scan it quickly, please. <coughs> Fitness and fun. He says no. All the time. Okay. So... Our uh, parents always know better and they always protect us, so we have to obey their orders. Okay, what is the website about? Tell me, what is the website about? Is it about a new car? Is it about fitness center? 
بنجاب هالتان Where do you click if you want to find out more about the center's facility? Where do you click if you want to find out more about the center's contact us? Contact us? What do you think? Okay, no problem. Where do you click if you want to become a member? Membership. Yeah. Membership. Good job. No problem. Good job, Sarah, by the way. Where do you click if you want to write an email to go for it? Where do you click if you want to write an email? Contact us. Good job. What information do members of GoForIt need to give to log in? Yes, contact us, sir. Username and password. Hmm, good job. So here are the answers. It's about a fitness center with special equipment. Click on read more. Click on membership. Click on contact us, username and password. So, yes, fine. Great job. Perfect. <laughs> now, read and write. T for true, F for false, or NM for not mentioned. Okay. A teacher opened the, the first go for it center. Jake Lewis wanted to find a fun way for teenagers to exercise. You can't find traditional gym equipment at go for it. There is a place where you can do your homework and go for it. No problem. Yes, we uh, actually, we couldn't add any audio files for this uh, uh, lesson because we are having like problems, uh, uh, technical problems with the website. Okay, vocabulary. Athlete, beat, click, comment, contract, oh, contact, energetic, facility, fee, final, fitness, gold, I can't get enough, in my view, log in, machine, middle, Offer, overweight, password, personal trainer, race, session, stick, take part, take place, technology, treadmill, unfit, up to date, username, Workout and workout. Okay. Choose the correct words. Robert is practicing or working out at the gym again. He wants to lose weight. So what do you think of the answer here, guys? Working out. Okay, so you think working out is the answer? My brother is practicing or working out for his art exam. Working out or practicing? What do you think, guys? Practicing. That was really fast, mashallah. Practicing. Good job. Ahmed couldn't take part or place in the race because he has broken his legs. 
uh, his leg, sorry, only one. Okay, part, not play. So you think part, half time? What do you think, Sarah? Part or place? Part as well. The swimming finals are taking part or place in Brighton this year. Taking part or taking place? Place? Place. Okay. Good job. Hey guys, you're so good, mashallah. Wonderful. So, yes. Robert is working out. My brother is practicing for his art. Exactly. Ahmed couldn't take part in the race because he has broken his leg. The swimming finals are taking place in Brighton this year. So, yes, guys, you have done a great job. Good job for you. Here are some stars. One, two, three, and four. Good job, guys. Hi, Naif, how are you? How was your weekend so far, Naif? Are you fine? Naif, uh, it looks like you are using a device. You are not using a computer. Anyway, no problem. Welcome to our class. No problem, Naif. Okay. Choose the correct words. Ahmed always wins or beats me at tennis because he is a better player. Beats. Beats. So both of you answered. Beats. Mm -hmm. The school basketball team won or beat yesterday's game? Won. Won. Good job. Okay. All the champions or the athletes in the 800 meter final were from Africa. Athletes. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Good job. Okay. No problem. Lewis Hamilton is the youngest Formula One world champion or athlete. Champion? Champion? Do you know Lewis Hamilton, guys? Do you know Lewis Hamilton? Okay, Hakan, mashallah, you are a good uh, uh, sport uh, fan. Mashallah, tabarakallah. Okay, no problem. He's a Formula One uh, driver. <laughs> okay. Ahmed always beats me at tennis because he's a better player. The school basketball team won yesterday's game. For Mercedes. Good job, Hattan. MashaAllah. All the athletes in the 800 meter final were from Africa. Lewis Hamilton is the youngest Formula One world champion. And good job. There are some tabs for you. You have answered all of them correctly, mashallah. Keep it up, guys. Keep it up. Choose the correct word. You're saying both won three gold prizes or medals in the 2012 Olympics. Medals. Medals as well. You know, I've seen uh, both. Do you know this guy? Do you know this guy? Oh, yes. He's the fastest man on earth, maybe. He's so fast, sir. You can Google this name after finishing the class, inshallah, and watch some videos for him. He is. So fast. My brother won first prize or medal in the art competition. Prize. Prize. Mm -hmm. 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 Mm -hmm.
Hi, good job. Good job. Nice, are you there? Okay. So, good job, guys. That was really nice. Choose the correct bird, the same bolt, won three gold medals in the 2012 or 2012 Olympics. My brother won first prize in the art competition. So, you have answered them correctly. Grammar. Hey guys, do you love grammar? Do you like grammar? Do you hate grammar? Really? Okay. Okay. Thank you for the fast answers tonight. Okay, no problem. Can could be able to. I can. I am able to use a computer very well. So when I say I can, it means I'm able to. When I say I am able to, it means I can, okay? We use can for ability. Do you understand me, guys? No, no, no. Sarah, so we are not choosing here. It means that they are the same, okay? Yeah, same meaning. Different words. Okay. We use can for ability. You know in Arabic, al qudra. If you are able to do something, ana qadir ala fi'il kaza. It's the same. Okay. I can, I am able to. No problem. I can swim. I am able to swim, for example. Okay, if you understand me now, type number one, please, if you understand me. Thank you, guys. Guys, you're awesome, mashallah, tabarakallah. Okay, <coughs> Nancy couldn't or wasn't able to finish her project last night. Same meaning, could not, was not able to. Same meaning, different words. Same meaning, okay? If you start training now, you will be able to take part in the tennis tournament. Will be able to in the future. Could, may, might. I saw Amir at the gym half an hour ago. I saw him. Half an hour ago. He could still be there. He may still be there. He might still be there. I want you to understand this situation, guys. I saw him half an hour at the gym. But I don't know if he is, uh, uh, if he is still there. He might still be there. He may still be there. He could still be there. I saw him half an hour ago. I don't know now what happened, okay? Must and can't. Abdullah has been working out all day. You know, working out. It's like Yetamarran, working out, okay? Abdullah has been working out all day. He must be really tired. He must be really tired. And here that what I think. It's like uh, a conclusion or something that uh, you have uh, known from this. Like in Arabic we say, it's in touch. He has been working out all day. So he must be really tired. I'm 100% sure that he is tired. Okay. Eddie had lunch about an hour ago at 5.21.
He can't be hungry. I'm 100% sure because we had lunch together an hour ago. He can't be hungry. No way. Do you understand me, guys? Must. Must is something you, you, you have to do. Like uh, Yejib knife. Okay? Must. Or when you are sure about something. Where is Muhammad? He must be eating. He must be eating. It means I'm sure that he is eating right now. We use can to express ability in the present. The baby can speak now. We use could to express ability in the past. I could climb trees when I was young, so could is the past. Could, past, can, present. Okay. Be able to expresses ability and forms all tenses. So be able to comes with present, past, and future as well. Okay. It is mainly used in tenses where we cannot use can. So if you cannot use can, use be able to. Do you understand me? Do you understand me? Good. Thank you, Sarah. Thank, thank you, Hatam. Nice. Did you understand? You want me to repeat? I can repeat that, it's okay. Okay, thank you. He'll be able to play football on Thursday. And here, uh, uh, what is the tense of this uh, sentence? Do you know the tense? Is it past, future, present? What do you think of the tense of this sentence? He'll be able to play tennis or to play football on Thursday. Future, good job, Hattan. So, Hattan, can we use can with future? He will can to play. He will can play. Can we say that? He will can. No, we can't. So, we use be able to. He will be able to play football on Thursday. Okay. We use may, might, and could to express possibility in the present or future. We use may, might, and could to express possibility. You know the word possibility? Do you know the meaning of the word possibility? Possibility. What is possibility, Hattan? Do you know? What is the meaning of the word possibility? Meaning something you can do. Okay. Possibility. Possibility. Good job, I told myself about it. You you can't. Mm. Possibility is uh, yeah. Can okay no problem. I can. Uh, possibility like in Arabic in Tamil. Okay. In the present or future. Might expresses slight possibility. Slight, very small. We may, might, impossible. Okay, good job. Yeah, I agree with you. We may go to the summer festival next weekend. We may. We might. We could. 
there is a slight possibility. We use may not or might not to express lack of possibility in the present or future. Henry may not or might not be able to join us. Must and can't express a logical deduction and refer to the present. We use must to express a positive deduction. Positive. We must go. Ammar has been working all day. He must be tired. He must. I'm 100% sure. It's like something you are... Not 100%, 1,000% okay? We use can't to express a negative deduction. So, we use can't to express a negative deduction. Tom can't be at home. I saw him at the bus stop five minutes ago. If you understand me, type number one. Okay, thank you so much. Now, choose the correct word. Say, couldn't or wasn't able to find your keys. So, she got in through an open window. Couldn't, wasn't able to, couldn't. So, Hatan said couldn't. Oh, Nihal, welcome to our lesson. Uh, okay, what do you think, Knife and Nihal? What do you think, guys? Couldn't or wasn't able to? Yeah, write down. Okay, wasn't able, had knife. So what do you think, uh, Nihal? I guess it's couldn't. Okay. Robert must or can't have a cat. He hates cats. Can't? What do you think, Naif and Nihal? Can't as well? Naif? Yeah, I want you all guys to try to answer. If you start taking Spanish lessons, you will be able to or you can speak Spanish in a few months. Will be able to. Can. Mm -hmm. Will be able to. What is no name? Able to? Okay, no problem. I will consider your answer. Welcome back, Sarah. Okay, choose the correct words. Say couldn't, yes. Robert can't, yes. You will be able to, yes. So everyone answered this question correctly. It's okay, sir. It's okay. No worries. No worries, sir. <clears throat> okay, choose the correct words. Andy. Must or can't be out. His car isn't in the garage. So what do you think? Must or can't? Quick, 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 quick. It's prayer time. Must? Must. Okay. Can't? Mm. Really, Nihal? His car is not. In the garage, it is not in the garage. So he must be out or can't be out. Okay. I'm not feeling very well. So I may or may not come to school tomorrow. May not, I may not. Mm -hmm. Because I'm not feeling very well. Welcome, Muhammad. Salih might or must 
beat Danny at tennis if he continues to play well? Might or must? Might, Hattan. I saw your answer. Mashallah, you are the first one answering every time. Oh, really? I'm really sorry for that, knife. Now if you can log out and log in again. Try to log out and log in again. Wa alaykum as -salam, Muhammad. Welcome. Okay, so two people answered might. Choose the correct word. Andy must be out. So I may not. Salih might. We are not sure. But probably. Okay. Thank you for participating. And thank you for, for attending this class. Here are the references for this uh, uh, lesson. Anytime, nice. Thank you for coming. Bye-bye.